Common Sister coming at you with another video with your midday report for AMC. All right. Now, I'll give you a couple minutes. Let people come on in. AMC is actually doing pretty good. Ham, what's up, Ham? Liquid Swords. Are you related to uh, Brenda, Queen of Swords? What's up, OG? I'm just fixing it. How y'all like the little setup now? Now you can see the chart while I explain the shit to y'all. <laughs> what's up, Edmund? What's up, Rico? I've just got a little midday report here. I want to explain what's going on with the stock. When's the rip? What's up? Melana, Jay, Mike, Mo, Ed Stock, Smith, Smith. Man, why you had to be the bad guy, Smith? <laughs> All right. I'm looking. I'm actually, I uh, came to bring y'all and AMC update. And I'm hoping that Frankie Muhammad or Phil for and Phil for real or Macedonian or somebody comes on because I want to try something new. I need their help. But how hey, y'all like the setup? Can y'all see the chart? Doing great, Vineyards. Thank you. I said vineyards. Y'all probably say vineyards up there. Can y'all see it? I believe we'll hit 20. Y'all know I did. Who's watched my new video that's already came out? Did y'all hear the blooper? What's up, Cupid Shoe? I'm supposed to be small. There, now I'm bigger, but you can't see the chart. <laughs> I got to learn how to use this thing. That's when I got more guests on. And then we come at the bottom. Oh. Oh, somebody's got to make the donuts sometimes. Frankie on. All right, if yeah, can y'all see that chart? I'm gonna go back to this one. I like this one while I'm trying to do the chart. Here we go with the chart. I'm gonna flip over here so I can see. As you can see, this is from this morning where we had an initial and down, and then we try to consolidate here and make a push back up. But here's the important thing I want y'all to notice that on the 28th we moved up from 1776 to 1790 it's not a big jump that was only a about a two percent jump but what it did was it left a gap and i was wondering if it would come back to try to fill that gap and what it looks like is it came it tested it went back up it's came it's tested it and it's moving back up i don't think i need to draw this out any further I think what it's doing is creating a W. And if it's creating that W, and I said it because it's the computer doing it, but if it if it is creating a W, it's gonna do it right there. It's gonna be the breakout point. We'll make it red because it ain't crossed it yet. But there it is. If we can get above that and hold one kill, yeah, we'll hit. Uh, 1960, something like that, maybe by the end of the day, 1950, 1960, something like that. If it gets here and moves on up, now it did one here, it broke down and then it broke down right here. So then it's done, it's done it again. And maybe we're moving for that second W push up, which is this is the Wyckoff chart, by the way, 
which is one that I've been studying with Rico. All right, down here on the bottom on the oscillator, it's still red, bright red. So it could pull back again and test it again right here before it decides to go. Lux Algo is telling us. that it's still a strong sell. So it's possible it could come back to test before the end of the day, before it makes its move up. And that's what I have for you on your updates. Let me see who's in here. Who's in here? Who's in here? Red Star, I see you, Jim. Money. Ally. Asian. Let me see. Can I scroll this thing down? No. Oh, I think I respond to y'all. Let's see. Get that over here. What up? Margin calls? Okay. Uh, margin calls. Let me tell you about that. I've done a video on that before. Oh, I can do that. Okay. All these catalysts and still no margin calls. Why? Well, first off, you got to understand the catalyst makes the stock move up. And then the margin calls happen. All right. Let me see. I can go back over here to my AMC. Let me turn the Lux off. Still in a strong sell, so we're not, but we don't sell. All right, let me get over here and show y'all something on chart about uh, catalysts and margins and stuff. Oh, need to be on a daily. Now, where are you at? Give me one second. I'm still getting used to this. All right. This is the Wyckoff chart that I use when I watch Rico. All right. So, here we go. It must want to run slow because I'm recording. Okay. January right here. Okay. Now I want you to look at the run up right here. All right, this is November, November, before the run-up right here in January. All right, but notice right here where you got these little periods here. Here, 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 boom. All right, this is, where's January? January's an even better one. Am I? That's the January run up to 20. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, January run up to 20. That's the one. Now watch this, people. You had a move. Boom, 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 boom. Take off. Okay? Look at that right there. This is what's important right here. This is why y'all hear me say it's going to $20, $30, $40, $50, because it's supposed to go boom, to 230, 290, 331, 
350, 473, 515. See that little time period right here? I'll put it in a box for you. That was when they was covering. Ever they were short, they were covering right there. Okay. Now, in this covering, the price moves up from $1.90 all the way up to $5.30. That's why I say from 19 to 50, that's going to be these little steps right here. Then you woke up and it was $20 a share. Remember when I keep telling you how you're going to wake up and it's $200 a share? That's where I'm getting this. All right. And then right here, this candle is what's important. This candle right here. This candle is January 28th. Does anybody know what the importance of January 28th is? And I'm not keeping up with the chats because I'm trying to teach a lesson. I don't know what y'all are talking about. Right now, I'm hoping y'all paying attention to what I'm showing you here. That in January, it went from $1.90 to $2.60 to $3.20 to $3.30 to $4.90 to $5.17. They woke up. It was $20. The next day, this happened. That was the buy button being taken away. The reason the buy button got taken away was Robin Hood and some of them turned the buy button off so that they could cover their short positions. That's why they turned it off to get retail out of the buy pool. They could buy up what they needed that day. And then the next day, everything resumed as it was supposed to. That's why this was taken. But the margin call. Do you hear me? The margin call happens after they start covering. They don't have to cover because of a margin call. They can start tapping out and this happens. All right. But the call to do it comes right here. It has to have a run up first. Then when the call comes, that's when they're going to halt it or they're going to suspend the buy button or whatever. So, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, Maddox, what's up, Scott, VT, I'm back now, I can see y'all's chats. Let's see, who I got in the chat here that's been with me for a while. What exchange? I buy it on Weeble. OG wants to know, what do you think about saying Sundial 30 day after AMC rips? Within 30 days? I would agree with that. Because I'm believing that it's probably going to run with it. But I'm hoping it don't. Come on later, where? <laughs> All right, so where are we at? <clears throat> Who we got in the house here, y'all? Ain't what's some questions? What is the difference between the purple, green, and red on the chart? Oh, that I had up here earlier? That's logo. I used it yesterday. Candles are going to change colors, right? And they're going to change colors. They're either going to be green, they're going to be red, or they're going to be purple or blue. All right? And what this program does is it tells you, it puts a bunch of the indicators together. Like if I wanted to go deeper with it, with the eye, we would go right here. 
and I would put in the reversal zones. And then we could see pretty much these are like Bollinger bands and all the Bollinger band uh, equations put together and so forth and put into one program. That's what these red and green ones are. And supposedly what happens is when it comes down and touches the green, it's supposed to rebound up. And then each, there's different layers of green, which are different layers of like your, uh, oh, they do that shit all the time. Um, where they have a whole bunch of lines that call out the percentages. I forget because I don't use it. Yeah. But that's what, yeah, that's just a little algo. It tells me when is a strong buy and when is a strong sell. And right now, it's telling me that AMC is not a, a buy. It's a strong sell. That's why it's red. All right. And it's pretty much running in the middle between the, these two bands. So we have to wait to see which direction the stock is going to go. And then once the trend changes, it'll switch to either a buy. Or strong buy. And I, I just bought that. I, I basically use it. I'm be honest with you for day trading, even though I don't trade uh, day trade. AMC. Uh, I still use it with AMC because I see when is a good time for me to uh, average down. So I don't just buy. Just because I have money in my pocket, I buy at the best time that it's to buy. So I can get the best price. That's Lux out. I'll go. go up here. 10 minute chart. And right now we bounced, we bounced, and we're wondering will we bounce again? Oh, it went crimson. So that's a good sign. See now how these work? This is the Lux oscillator. It's Crimson, uh, blood, blood, red, blood, red, and then it goes downhill just like what? A MACD uh, histogram. And it's that's the MACD and your RSI and one or two other here's all rolled into one, one down here. That's why I use it and just share that with y'all. Am I going to what? <laughs> now, see, I probably just got demonetized for that. <laughs> I just got in trouble because Ralphie wanted to know was I going to drink anything, and I'm drinking it now. No, the Moash is not this week. They're go they're going to start covering pretty heavy this week, which is going to push the price up, and then they get the margin calls. I don't know about Super Trend. I just, I love Lux Algo. Uh, Super Trend might be good. I will be, hold on. Slick got something he want to say. Slick got something he want to say. It's going to hit 50 this week. I say that every week. I will be right one week. But I say that every week for a reason, because I know that there's a stair-stepping process I just showed y'all. If you missed it, go back in the video. I show you the stair-stepping process that it takes. Now, I wish Frankie was on. No, they're going to get 300 pretty fast. I don't know what the fuck you talking about. We're going to be, but we're not selling at three. That's the thing. Depends on what you want to. All right, let's get this out the way. Bluegrass says, is Lux Algo serving you well? I'm thinking of purchasing this in two. Thanks. I've used it for actual trading twice. 
all right and both of them has been with shiba inu that lets me know because i can do that i can use it with with bitcoin or uh, cryptocurrencies too so i know when the best time to jump in on shiba inu is and when it hits when it says sell i sell that motherfucker lux algo when lux algo tells me to sell i sell it and i just ping pong it like that so yeah it's doing me okay uh purchasing it it would depend on why you want to purchase it are you a day trader you know do you want to try to use it with this play because i'm going to show you every day according to the lux algo what amc is doing so you don't need to purchase it for that but if you're a day trader or gonna be yeah you're sitting on a billion ship you're doing awesome adrian i ain't supposed to smoke but I figure I'm in my motherfucking house smoking a cigarette and YouTube's going to correct me. <laughs> All right. Anybody got any questions? Brenda, what are you doing, girl? You don't scare me. You scare the rest of the YouTubers. <laughs> yeah it is for uh my crypto that's what i'm using it for my crypto trading i look at it now before i i'm not buying amc right now but if i was buying amc i would want to see if lux algo said that now's the time to buy because they're saying right now that it's not so i'll wait until it tells me that it is Oh, I believe it's going to take time to vineyards. I'm hoping for three. <laughs> Thank you. I'm not, I'm not smart. I'm not stupid. They call me, you dumbass. I said, hold on, bitch. I went to college. I'm a smart ass. Well, I was hoping, oh, um, Frankie would jump in. But I had a question for him. No. Nope. Yeah, I got a new look, man. I got this here going on where I can uh bring on guests, and then when the guests get here. We can either be like this or this. I mean, I went and bought that so I could do shit like this. Because I'm going to tell you what I got going on for tonight. Okay. Where's my paper? I got a couple of people in mind that I'm trying to get that I want to hold a live with like this. And we're going to talk about what's your conviction. That's going to be the topic that I want to have tonight on my live stream which will probably be around nine o'clock oh yeah oh yeah we're stepping it up we're stepping it up i figure you know and you might laugh about this one but a little ad revenue shit come in so i bought lux algo for us i bought the new computer so y'all could see me do y'all notice there's no fucking beeping <laughs> Nobody's missing the beeping noise. If y'all ain't been with me for a while, in the beginning, there was this beep, beep, beep. We couldn't find that motherfucker. I searched this house up and down. I finally found it, though, and threw that bitch away. So no more beeping. And then I said, man, they complaining about the fogginess. So I went and got a new computer. You better go see Sundial before. I've already went in Sundial. I'm thinking to turn this Sunday off and say goodbye, good night to y'all for a few minutes. I wonder how, how long is this thing? It ain't telling me how long. Oh, there it is, 25 minutes. 
All right. Any questions? I ought to have a few questions, huh? Tony? No, Tony don't want to come on my show. <laughs> Wait a minute. Wait a minute. What's going on here? Hold on. I'm glad you said the entertainment part. You know, we deserve for the entertainment part because, I mean, that's all I'm really doing is entertaining y'all. Y'all are entertaining me. Updated brackets. I don't have an updated bracket. I've always had the same bracket. Um, I'm going to. I don't want to talk about it. I don't need people get, get mad. We're not going to talk about brackets. I've only used it three times, I think, Lux Algo. And I mean, I haven't lost. <laughs> I'd interview Al from Boston. I want to know what monument he was plan planning on bringing her to. <laughs> versus Tony, what will we fight about? I'm not going to argue with somebody who's just argumentable. When's the Moass? April. You know, Spy's down and AMC's down. AMC's down to, let me take a look. Yeah, it can't be. Yeah, we're talking about it's going to maybe do a second bounce before it goes. Because it just turned crimson down here and it's down by the green. That's the oversold. So we're ready for a move up. It's got to come down and make balance first. <laughs> Why don't these people? <laughs> no, I'm not going to be ugly. What's my opinions on earnings? Well, I'll tell you what my, let me do this. Get up there. <laughs> Why April? All right, Jeep, I'm going to give you the answer to that question. Do I think the U.S. government wants to cover this a a says people are starting to hit long-term capital gains with their AMC shares. No. Yes, they want the tax money. Do I think they want this over ASAP because of the tax money? No. They could have waited on the tax money. But certain things have happened in the world, such as BlackRock, and I don't give a fuck who disagrees with me. I know I'm right. BlackRock, I'm always right when I'm talking about conspiracy shit. BlackRock is so deep in the Russian stocks and bonds. And don't forget their involvement in Evergrande Day. Evergrande Day. They're bleeding now. See, it was the hedgies bleeding before. Now it's them bleeding. They're bleeding out the ass with, with, you know how many billions upon billions of fucking dollars in Russian stocks BlackRock has. Give me a break. <laughs> and uh, we'll talk about that. 
people are saying, oh, yeah, but it's going to listen. Them bitches is just as deep in Russia as they are over here in America. But that's it. Who said they caught me live? Let's see. You caught me live, but I was hanging up, girl. What's Joseph saying? Wimsy's here. I don't. Can I? How do you make moderators in this damn thing? She's a moderator. She'll put his ass out if whoever's saying something crazy. Cause I'm missing it. I was doing a class. <laughs> Everybody, listen. Listen to me. Listen to Smith. Let me. Let me hit that. Where you at, Smith? I want y'all to see what Smith said. If I can get it to working right. It'll catch up. Come on, man. I'm trying to bring up a question. I guess I could turn that on. Man. All right, seems I'm having technical difficulties here. So we're going to end the stream now. I'm trying to set something up for 9 o'clock Central discussing conviction in your play and how Oh, thank you. Yeah, we will burn some shit. I'm getting ready to do that. Uh, I can't hit, I can't get no fucking influencer to help me, so I'm gonna have to go figure out how to do it myself, and I'll do it live. That's why I've got this shit here. I will go and we will burn the ship live, then we'll go to the wallet and we'll confirm that it's burned. Oh, I agree. It, I agree. All YouTubers making videos, it's against their God money. I don't understand what that means, but okay. Look, okay, Frank, let me ask you a question. Did we have all these rules and regulations in place in January? No. Did it run up from $1.91 to $20? Yes. Without them policies? Yeah. Okay, from January to June, when it ran up to 72, did we have all these policies? Did it run up to 72? What's my point? It's going to fucking run up anyway. You don't need these policies. These policies are covering for the fucking algorithm. This is why it's going up. It's going up anyway because it done went up once before or three times before. <laughs> so it's going to do it again. This is just the cover for it so that they can keep it going. They don't want to keep this one going because we got it figured out. Nothing means anything. I said, oh, uh, March 3rd is judgment day. Motherfucker, that has nothing to do with it. What I want to scream at him. You know goddamn well them policies don't mean nothing to this squeeze. It's going to squeeze because of the computer program. This is just a cover. 
Oh, yeah, it's squeezed because of this. Don't get me started because I will get fired up over this. I hate when they're wrong about something and just will not correct themselves. I'm down with you, stock market junkie. Let's get this shit over with. I'm tired of these motherfuckers that talk to us every day. No, no, no. Yes, no, they could have waited on the taxes. They wouldn't have gave a shit. What I'm saying, the reason they moved it up was not because of the taxes. The reason they moved it up is because they Ukraine and Russia went at it and Putin has fucked all the banking systems up. And now BlackRock is the one bleeding instead of the hedges. Well, the hedges are still bleeding. There's blood in the water from every fucking body. Put it like that. Don't hold your nuts on, Lou. <laughs> Run up Wednesday. I will give Lou every bit of the credit of this motherfucker. Just run up, bitch. Oh my God. Tell me about it, Adrian. We've had 369. We've had 222222. Two, 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 two. And now we got the policies that's going to do it. We got the earnings tonight that can do it. We had an Evergrande that was that fell that was supposed to do it. I mean, we could go on and on and on. You gotta look for the you gotta look for the clues, Davenport. When's the algo gonna let it run? It's gonna you'll know it's running when it starts stepping up. Ernest goes to Moaz. That's it. I'm offended. And <laughs> I'm signing off. Now, I love y'all. Be blessed. And I'll see y'all tonight. I plan on doing a live about y'all's. Still, no, that's what I'm saying. Evergrande still no. They've not had a catalyst yet. Putin doing what he did, fucking the world's banking system up. That's a catalyst. Talk to y'all later. I love y'all.